Hello YouTube, hello MGTOW. This is me, MGTOW in the wind. You know, I think it's about time somebody gets into the specific nitty gritty details of single mothers. And I'm going to do it based on my, my observations, my experiences, and my, from, from my understanding of the MGTOW, of some of the people in the MGTOW community and the management. Let's start with this. There are, sing yes, the sing there are categories of single mothers, and right now I haven't put them all in the categories yet. Now, the different categories of single mothers are, well, first off, there's the ones that were actually raised to be to have some sort of reason and logic. Not many, not that many. So basically, not that many. And then, there, and, and then there's ones. This is for, for those ones. Yes, sadly, you're gonna be put in. You're always, but but for one thing they all have in common. You're always gonna be put behind her, behind the child. Behind whatever you're going to be their last, you're probably going to be anywhere near the second to last or last priority. So don't get too, don't get too excited. Don't get, don't get too thrilled. And, and that nookie, you might not get it because now she, because she has trust issues from her last man or men that she slept with. Because now her brains work apparently. It took you long enough. Now let me break this to you, what I've, what I've seen with single mothers. What I've seen with single mothers is... I've seen... If, it, if it's not her causing you problems, it's her exes. The, the baby daddies. The one she slept with. Now, some of the ways she causes problems is she's gonna get violent. She gets violent. She gets violent and uh, what's the word? Abusive. Because that's what she that's what she got. Because that is what she got. She gets abusive. You know? Especially if you're shorter than her. She gets abusive. Very abusive. Like, shoot, like I said, I, I've, I've walked in on people getting shot with a BB gun and getting the call, cops call on, called because the man has been shot with a BB gun. They manipulate, they, I mean, they, you know, my own family. I told her, I, I kept, I told my own family, you know. They get, they, they get abusive. They can be abused because that's the men that they dealt with. That's the men that they dealt with. And now they're taking it out on you. It's just that simple. So you still think like you still think that you still think you want to take the risk of dating a single mother? Oh you no, know, yeah, you still want to take the risk. How about this? How about this? They'll, they'll literally set you up for failure. Now, my own family almost lost his right to carry on, to, to bear. Almost lost his gun rights, almost lost his freedom, almost spent, he spent nights in jail because of her. He almost got ran over because of that woman. Think about it. Think about it. This, and you know what? This is, this is going to be a share session on videos, you know? This is going to be a share series on videos. He almost got put in jail. He almost got killed. You know? Here's another scenario that, that you, might, you might appreciate with single mothers. If you still feel the need to date a single mother. 
they might accuse you of messing around with their children. Who's the girl's gonna believe, her or you? Now here's the, here's a here's a true sickness here. This one will make you sick. A single mother will bring a sex offender into her home. A registered offender on the megas list and everything. Before she ever brings a reasonable a responsible adult. A responsible adult. Think about that. Registered offender. If that right there does not convince you to leave a single mother alone, maybe this will. Now she might not be the uh, might not be the she might be the problem for the first part, but the second half is going to be her, her her baby daddy. The baby's daddy. Still be the baby's daddy. You know? It's gonna be the baby daddy. You wanna know how it's gonna be the baby daddy? Because nine times in ten, nine times in ten in certain neighborhoods, she's messing with a criminal. Some sort of criminal, some sort of adult, uh, some sort of abusive person. And, she, and he's going to try to set you up to go to jail. He's going to try to pin some charges. In, in Pittsburgh, in Pittsburgh, they got these, this thing called tag, where you can get a lesser sentence if you tag someone else for a crime. You try to tag the crime on somebody else. You know? That's how they, that, I mean, that, I mean, that might be like you try to tag a crime on somebody else. Think about that. You still think single, you know, single mothers is, is worth it? Look, I know there are single mothers that have gotten out of a, a bad relationship, a bad marriage, a bad whatever, due to, safe, due to the fear of the safety of her and her children. Her and them children. I don't hate anybody. You know, I know there are some other people, single mothers and fathers, that have gotten their children out of an abusive relationship. More so, it's it's more difficult. But I'm saying is, it's more difficult for a man to take his children out of a dangerous situation than it is for a woman. It is more dangerous. I mean, it is it is more difficult for a man to take the children out of the danger, out of a dangerous situation than it is for a woman. That's what I'm saying. I'm saying what it is. You may not like it, but it's what it is. Some of these mixed out. So let's do. Let's go with the ones who didn't pull their, themselves up by their uh, bootstraps and at least try to learn how to, how to how to operate as a man, or or, or haven't learned how to operate as a man. You put they pull these this petty BS. This petty BS. First off, doxing. Or it, it, it's basically another form of office manipulation. So because you don't like what a, what a content provider provides, this MGTOW, 
you're going to run to the boss. And try to get this person fired because you didn't like what That is the same thing. That is the same thing a woman does when a man talks to her or says good morning to her when, she, when he's not of her liking, not of her status preference, not of her financial preference, not of her status pre preference, hierarchy's preference. That is the same thing a woman does. Instead of walking away and leaving the person, leaving the, the content, and ignoring the content creator that you don't like, you try to dox the content creators. Aren't we supposed to be men? Last time I checked, last time I checked, we're supposed to be men. But I'm, maybe I'm wrong. Oh, what the flying hell is this? But, uh, last time I checked, we're supposed to be men, right? You sure ain't acting like it. Run tell that. Just because you're, just because you're a fellow big I don't mean you can't get it too. Don't mean you can't get it too. Big tail, red pill, I don't care. Red pill, black pill, doesn't matter to me. If, you're, if, if I see some things, I'm going to say it. If I see things, I'm going to say it. You may not like it. Going behind other people's backs. On YouTube. Like, actually, better yet, better description. Airing your problems out on social media. You know, to be honest with you, I'm surprised nobody has, nobody's called us bitch made. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm female dog made. I'm surprised nobody's called us female dog made. You know? From, from how we act. We dox each other. Because we don't like each other. Instead of leaving each other alone. Make sure that we can't that 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 would make it difficult for us to live because we can't leave it walk away and leave each other alone. But I think many of you still need to look inside of yourself. And un fornicate your brain if it's big you look it because MGTOW is under a microscope it's under a microscope we are getting picked through with a fine tooth comb now We continue this cat for this this scenario that is cat fornicated sideways. They get labeled as a hate group. Oh, we can fix ourselves. And hopefully make some sort of improvements on our own lives. Because isn't that what men isn't that what men going their own way means? Go your own way as a man. 
You didn't admit you're not supposed, you're not look, you're looking for you, you get your own validation. Isn't that what it is supposed to be? We're supposed to self-focus on self-improvement. Taking that utter out of your mouth is a, is a start. Might be, it might just be a start, you know? Separating that umbilical cord might be a start. Taking that womb from your mind, removing the womb from your mind might be a start. I don't know. It seems like a good start to me. I am going to say this now. To the big town that have taken the red pill and managed to make, to make progress of removing the womb from their mind, the umbilical cord from the back of their neck, and the udder from the from their voice box. I commend you. In fact, I applaud you. Because you have done what a lot of these other MGTOW are having a problem with. Can't, can't seem to grasp. I applaud you on your self-improvement. I've, look, I've been looking around MGTOW for about a whole year, for about a year and some change. Two years? Wow, two almost three years and I've seen a lot of people a lot of people that need to remove the female dog thought from their mind this is Big Town to Win signing off